to my day in it. Have a fast day. Ugh. I've just got back from taking a room to the bus. It's already really hot. So it's going to be about 27 degrees today. But the thing is, it's not even sunny. It's just absolutely like boiling with no sun. So everyone's just like hot, sweaty messes. Um, yeah, it's going to be a sticky one today, I think, rather than nice and sunny, unless the sun comes out in a bit. But at the minute, there's no sun. So I'm just making myself a nice cup of 30. Winifred, I think that's how everybody feels. Look, ugh. Anybody get any sleep last night? <laughs> England is just not set up for this hot weather. So even when you open your windows and stuff, it makes no difference, apart from you get loads of spiders and flies in. Um, and you just melt, basically. Um, we always crave sunshine and heat, and then when we get it, all we do is moan, which is quite funny, really. Um, anyway, so today's nail day. Ba -da! I really don't want to go and have my nails done in this heat, but I thought I'd have them done so that when I get to my birthday, I've got really nice nails. So I think I'm gonna have green done. I've never, ever, ever had green nails in my whole life. And I thought, do something different, Jane, because it's your birthday. Have something you've never done before. So I found a really pretty design on the internet. So I think I'm gonna have that done. I'm not gonna look at any other nail designs because again, there's so much choice on the internet. It just blows your mind. And when you struggle making decisions like I do, it just blows my head and I can't choose. <laughs> I'm rubbish at making decisions. Um, anyway, I hate having my nails done. My anxiety goes, Phew. So I'm feeling anxious, sweaty and horrible. But like a lot of you have said, you know, you inspire, I inspire you to face my fears and you lot inspire me to go. So yeah, thank you for that. So we need to get, an, get on and have a cup of tea and waffling. Anyway, good morning. Mm. So last night I did do a quick bit of washing and I hung it in here, but then the trouble is it dries a bit like cardboard when you dry it inside here. So maybe I should actually go and hang it out and stop being lazy. <laughs> Well, I don't think it's being lazy, but it's just like doing it twice, isn't it? But then I think if I leave it to dry, it's going to set like concrete. Right, hair done, makeup done. I've slapped my hair back again because it's just too hot to have your hair down around your neck. So I did wash it all last night. My colour's faded so much already. My hair is quite orangey. And I was like, oh, I really need to redo it, but I'm just going to slap it back for today. So morning. Me, uh, beautiful Flora, Pat Peggy, we need to wake them all up because we've gone a bit sleepy. Little Bubba, positive potato, big, big hugs if you're struggling. I know life can be very, very hard. And again, like I said yesterday, I know the heat can make you feel a bit funny sometimes. So try and keep cool, big, big hugs. And don't forget, we're all here for each other. Um, calendar of the day, the magic of new beginnings. That was lovely yesterday. Today, you've got 24 hours to spread cheer. Ready, set, go. Yeah, we always spread a bit of cheer, don't we? Um, so, Black Cab Wisdom, we've got... Be so busy with the importance of yourself that you have no time to criticise others. Oh, very fancy. Right, and Baby Yoda moment. Take a moment, are you ready? Get ready, breathe. <sighs> we definitely need that sometimes, don't we? <laughs> Happy Tuesday. Breakfast. So breakfast this morning. We've got blueberries and bran plates. Bran plate for my little friend. The only friend that's come this morning. My favourite little foodie, Florence. Boring jobs. So we need to wash up. Empty dishwasher. And we've got to leave. My appointment's at half 10, so it's 10 past 9. So I've got to leave about 10-ish, something like that. So we've got a little bit of time to get a few jobs done before we go. Super cute calendar of the morning. So, go lightly like a butterfly and find what fills you, what enlivens you, and what you love. Here I am. So I've thrown on what I had on yesterday because I didn't feel quite too hot yesterday. That didn't make any sense at all, did it? It was quite cool yesterday, so I thought, oh, I'll get away with wearing this again today before I chuck it in the wash. So, uh, cream little shorts and loose blouse. I think sometimes when you wear something tighter, it makes you feel hotter. So if you can wear like a loose, sort of blouse or something. I think it's cooler than like a thicker fitted t-shirt, if that makes sense, if that's any advice at all. Um, so lipstick of the day today is, I've mixed two together again. I've got Avon Power Stay lipstick and I've got on Can't Quit Cafe and Barely Baked. And my anxiety is already like, 
I absolutely hate going and I get so angry with myself because it's a nice thing and it should feel nice to go and have it done. But all I can think about is please hurry up and get it done and my heart starts pounding and I feel all shaky and like just want to get out of there. And it's horrible. And that's just me being really, really truthful. I know some people will be like rolling their eyes going, oh, whatever. But it's so true. And if you suffer with mental health, you'll know just where I'm coming from. And this is the crap side of mental health. Well, there is no good side of mental health, but this is like one of the horrible sides. It stops you from doing things that you would like to do. So you have to really push yourself. Um, yeah, so I've got to leave in like 20 minutes and I'm already like not relaxed at all. Anyway, we need to sort ourselves out and get going. Right, I'm ready to go. Look at Dolly. She makes me feel so bad when I leave her. She's like, don't leave. Don't leave me this way. I won't be long. <laughs> I wish you could come with me. We've arrived. So I've actually had to park in the supermarket car park because the normal place where I normally park, they've now put signs up saying you can't park there unless you're in an electric vehicle and it's charging which is so horrible, so discriminative against normal little cars. Um, so there was loads of spaces, but obviously you can't park there unless you're charging your electric vehicle, which is absolutely bonkers. Right, so anyway, a little bit further to walk, but never mind. Let's go. Monday next week, this is my mum's 80th birthday. So if you want to shut it. Okay. 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 Top flight. Um, it's just Jim Lewis women. Can I have them? I said, no, you can't. You'll sell them on eBay. Don't tip.
I've actually arrived home because the man in the car park was talking to me and I thought I can't get in my car and start filming now. Um, so I spoke to this lovely gentleman who was a bar in person and he was like, I just absolutely love it. And he said, do you know what? He went, it's an absolute pleasure to have part next to your little pink car. And I was like, oh, that's so cute. Thank you so much. So I made his day because he parked next to me. <laughs> I was like, yeah, but it's so slow. <laughs> it's a bit, it's a bit slow when you've got the aircon on it, like drains the power a little bit. So poor Percy's very slow, but I love him. Um, oh, there's a parcel man here. Hmm. The parcel was for my husband. It wasn't for me. Anyway, so yeah, so the man said it was a pleasure to park next to my pink car, and it made him very happy, and that's so lovely. Uh, right, so I've got my nails done. Woohoo! So I've fought my anxiety and went and had them done. Um, so this was the picture that I showed her, and she did it exactly the same. They're so clever, aren't they? These nail technicians. Look at it. It's just exactly the same as the picture. So it's like different greens. Um, I've never ever had green nails, and I think they're really nice. Uh, really nice for a change, but yeah, it wasn't too, it was quite hot in there, it wasn't too bad. And the poor gentleman, the lady did my nails, and then the poor gentleman next to me had hay fever, the man who was working. Oh, I felt so sorry for him, bless him, he was sneezing, and had to keep nipping out to blow his nose, and hay fever is so awful, James suffers with it, and my hubby does, and it's awful, I feel so bad for anybody that's got hay fever. Anyway, I'm waffling, it's 25 past 12, I need to have a quick bit of dinner, then we're going to see my mum. So I need to hurry up. Right, super fast dinner so that we can get to my mum's house. So it's already half past 12. Right, ham salad sandwich, cob, whatever you call it. Let's go, let's eat it. Ooh. Chicken, chick, 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 chicken. Oh, steady, he <laughs> nearly knocked Florence over. Right, there you go, Florence. There you go, darling. And I think Winnie must be hiding in the room. We better go and find her. Sleeping beauty herself. Winnie Fred, here you go. What do you think? No, you're not pinching it. Oh, hurry up. Winifred, that's a piece of chicken. Come on. Really? <laughs> well, if you don't worry, your friend's going to eat it. I can't hold it back much longer. That's it, good girl. Was that nice? <laughs> Right, back in the car. Let's go and see my mum. Dolly was desperate to come. It's probably a little bit hot for her, but the car has got really good air con. So let's go. <laughs> Say let me in. <laughs> see your little face. <laughs> yes, of course. That doesn't go in. No. I wind it. I bet it was there. So, when we come to my mum, she even has colour-coded moths. Look at that. It matches the blind. No, not. Yeah, it matches your roof. Not your roof blind, your looks thing. Not the looks. Awning, that's the word I'm looking for. Look at my mum's garden. Oh, it's beautiful. I think you have a gardener, really. These, these grass, <laughs> look at what that. These long tufts, they're about that long. Of grass? Yeah. yeah. My mum's got a fairy as well, look. And look what my mum's got in the garage. I was trying to pinch it because I thought it was nice, but I thought she'd just bought it and it's oh. old. How old do you reckon it is? Oh, nine, ten, hundred years. She used to make butter. My grandma, your great grandma. Yeah. On the farm. So it actually was in the house, yeah, not. Yeah, it was some food. Yeah. Like water or something. Yeah. Look at that. That's so yeah. interesting. My mum's got lavender in it. Dry lavender. It smells nice. Wow, if that pot could talk, that's amazing. Yeah, yeah. So Dolly knows where the treats are kept when she comes to Grandma's house. <laughs> she doesn't really want toys anymore. She does still like toys. Here's my mother, we haven't actually seen her. Yes, she is. Yay! Hi, everyone. <laughs> so, Lovely day, isn't it, for us all? <laughs> a bit hot. Well, yes, it's a bit too hot. Really. Are you ready? So, my mum's going to sing and the dog's going to join in. Yes, the dog is happy. Are you ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, my dear Jane. Happy Ooh. birthday to you. Yes, Yay. Yay. <laughs> right, let's make a wish. Yes, make a wish. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Yeah, happy birthday! Yes, my cake. Lovely jubbly. It's not regret and shame about the cake. <laughs> She's disgusting stuff in the paper. 
We're inspecting my mum's sunflowers now. And Lorraine, okay. my mum's just said, I was saying how you wanted one of these cloud trees. Um, and my mum got it from home base. So there was it was about £80, but compared to the price in garden centres, that is not a bad price at all. And she's had it ages now, which is obviously why it's quite big. Um, but they're absolutely stunning. So check out your home base, see if you can get one. And the other. I've got some sunflowers in pot, but mine haven't done anything. Not like this. That's the one that they actually had a drop, you know, a bit on the broke a bit off it. What? Oh, the, the hydrangea. hydrangea. Yeah. You oh, that's it. nice, isn't it? Yeah, it's got it's like. Coming a... now, so I think. Yeah, it's got like a black it. stem, isn't it? Yes. Yes. I love hydrangeas. Yes. Because uh, I. Yeah, so they've got, got aren't snails. They? I don't think that's snails, it's probably the ewes or something. I don't but they're healthy though. Yeah. yeah. Keep laughing how Dolly follows my mum about. It's so funny. Is she coming, Dolly? Where is she? Where is she gone? Is she coming? Come on, mother. We're leaving. Everyone's got older Dolly, Dolly's like, don't leave me here. <laughs> Oh, so lovely to see you. Thanks, Mickey. Yes, now we're both out. Mm. <laughs> Many more to come. Hopefully, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. And don't forget everyone, one day at a time. We can all manage a bit better then. <laughs> so many people take that advice more than you know. Yeah, I told a friend. Uh, I haven't seen her for a long time. I told her, just, oh, that's a good advice. I should remember that. Yeah, yeah. one day at a time. <laughs> yeah. Very good. You can cope, can't yeah. you? Yeah, yeah. So we'll see you soon. Yes, bye to everyone. Wow, we're leaving Percy behind. So my dad's old car um, has got a problem with the exhaust, so I'm taking the car home for my hubby to fix it. Um, so we're leaving Percy here. Bye Percy, it's very sad. Right, let's go home. And that's what you get greeted with when you come home. <laughs> Winifred, have you missed us? Hey, have you missed us? We're going to grandma's. 20 past four. The tea is in the oven, so we're having lasagna tonight and garlic bread. So I'm doing it now. Um, my hubby's going to have his, then he's going off to work, then I'll have mine in a bit. I've got my birthday cards off my mum, bless her. Ta -da! Um, and then she also got me some flowers out of a garden. How cute are they? She was like, I didn't buy you a big bunch, I just made them out of the flowers in my garden. I think that was just so sweet and so special, bless her. And in a bit, I'm going to do a fake tattoo. Ta -da! Can you remember these from last year? They're so good. Right. We're now going paper delivering and some magazines of mine. She likes Vogue, so I always save my Vogue for her, for her to read. She loves it, bless her. I'm back and there's no pink cars here. Dun, 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 dun. So I've supposed to set my mum's and Blossom's gone off to her new home. So there's no pink cars on the drive. And then I've just noticed this. My nails are the same colour as one of Fiat's car keys. Look, how weird is that? That's so funny. <laughs> Look, you couldn't have got a better colour if you tried. So, 10 to five. Before I have my lasagna, I'm going to have um, a Planet Spa by Avon um, bath elixir. It's very thick and smells absolutely beautiful. So I thought I'll have a nice refreshing bath, freshen myself up, ready for my birthday tomorrow. I'm going in. I'll see you on the other side. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is my tea. So I'm all washed, bath, nice and clean. So I've got lasagna, garlic bread, salad, off to enjoy it. My dinner was lovely. And now I'm sat here. The football started. Oh, so it's not England yet. It's England later. But that's all that's on the telly. It's football. Right. It's feeding time. So we've got a little bit of chicken and dinner tonight. No, that's not yours. Winnie Fred. Okay, feeding up. Right, and last but not least, Dolly, go! Come on then! Don't <laughs> knock into her leg. Right, hang on. Get the door open. There you go! 
the fake tattoos are underway. <laughs> so there's rubies. They're ever so good. They start off faint like this, and then by probably tomorrow they go really dark and they actually look like little fake like little toes. They're so good. I got mine off eBay. Love them so much. The arm tattoo has entered the building. Dun, dun, dun. So they do take a couple of days to come out. So probably should have done it yesterday, but it's so pretty. It's just on the inside of my arm. Um, they last about is it two weeks or something. They're really cool. Then I've done a little tiny one on this arm. I don't know if you can see it. Just a little tiny one there. I love them so much. Anyway, my dears, I'm going to love you and leave you. So many thanks for joining me again on my little birthday eve. I hope you've enjoyed it. So if you do enjoy just a little bit of real life, please subscribe to my channel. Oh, and I saw it. I keep missing people's birthdays. I think lovely Lisa, not Lisa Lemons, the other Lisa. I think it was your birthday as well the other day. So if it has been your birthday in the last couple of days, happy birthday. There's loads of people's birthdays at the minute. I don't know why. So all the best people are born in June. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. So anyway, thanks for being there with me. My little website is down below and my little Avon shop is also down below. So I love you and leave you. I'll see you tomorrow. You can share my special day with me. I'm not really doing anything exciting. I think we'll visit work and that. So we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.